Hey everybody, the rookie here, and welcome back to another episode of Sword Coast Legends. So, uh, la in the last episode, we just uh, figured out this puzzle, unlocked the door, so now it's time to see oh, yeah. what is in on the other side of it. Sure. Taking our rogue first. Actually, before we even do that, let's go ahead and level up these guys. Grab sneak attack. What are some of these ones? Rivalry. That's a party boost. And no, we'll take some necrotic damage added to our weapons. That's not bad. So our cleric, we're, first we're going to go see the healing tree. Uh, I don't think I, I need to unlock the, the last level in the uh, healing spell yet. I don't... my guys don't have that many hit points, so... No. Okay, we'll go over here. So we got level 2 Blessing. That one's, a, that one's not bad. I'm going to grab this one. It's a Resurrect. And we're going to grab aid level 2. On to our mage, who we're specializing in fire. Right here. So he uh, has to be level 11, so we can't unlock fire bolt yet. I don't like over channeling, not quite yet. I need some, some good healing and stuff before I can do that, because he takes constant damage. Don't really use this Ephir. We'll get it. Maybe I'll start to use it. Manipulation. No, no, no. Arcane. See, I think this is passive, this armor, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna grab that one. A little bit more damage. What are these ones? Magic weapon. I don't really use that at all. We'll grab the uh, the magic missile level four, level four. Pardon me. Sounds like okay. A All right. If you say so, I'll take that. Prayer of healing and a scroll. Not bad. We're gonna go ahead and pull the rest of our of party course. through. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. So, this is the Master's Library. Be careful. I don't know... Ah, finally. My last remaining apprentice has returned. Oh, no. You heard that too, right? Ah, join me, apprentice. In death. You will join your fellow students in my service. Forever. Yeah, we're going to say you have to go through us. We've got to protect no, our buddy. You will not stop me. Uh, she is going to cast Bless. How may I say? Talos charging on yes, in, pulling my guys back. Need my rogue. Sounds going like to use one. ranged weapon for the time being. By your lead. Yes. Now As we're going to pull wish. her. Uh, she's going to use aid, and then we'll pull her back. The perfect strike. Yes. Okay, we're gonna switch. What can I do for you? I hear you. Hit her to attack. Mean? We're gonna get him to cast Firebolt. We're gonna try and focus down his little shades here. 
Except for Talo, he's gonna stay on that guy. Did okay. You need something? Gonna go ahead and grab this guy. What can I do for you? Go ahead and poison something our I weapons, cast a firebolt. At your service. This regeneration? Yes, we're gonna grab it. Just to keep some regeneration going, get back in there. What can I do for you? Yes? What? What is it you require? Oh, I think these guys are being held. I don't know if I can release us or not. Nice, I did. How may I serve? What's up? By your leave. Okay, well, it looks like he just got him right back, so... What do you need? Yes? He's doing good. Just gonna Can go ahead and cast some spells. At your service. Where did they go? At once. I hear you. Wreath them in flames. I, can do. I think this is going to be a long fight. I'm here to help. What is it you require? Did you need something? She's going to cast heal on my rogue here. How may I serve? Over here! Help! Oh, Talo needs lay on hands. Yes? See if we can't pull yes. him free. Those are all on cooldown. I'm gonna cast fireball. By your leave. I can do Group that. everybody back up over in the corner. Get on him. Uh, where's what can I do? Our priestess you? is going to cast some healing on Talo again. Yes. Anyone over there? I hear you. I'm gonna pull her up and use her prayer of healing. Make sure everybody's in range of it. Boom! This there we go. At your service. What is it you require? There we go. Pain. I haven't felt that in so long. Master, I'm sorry. No, it is I who has lost his mind. Death has no doubt clouded your thoughts. No, it is the rage that brings the confusion. Nothing more. So we're just going to see what we can get what we need and then leave. Ah, you are members, yes? As was I before. I have dedicated years studying the history of our guild. Fascinating and not a little disturbing. Our guild was founded roughly a century ago by two brothers, Roth and Gareth Dawntreader. They learned of the legend of a stone, a tear of the elven goddess of the moon, one they believed would allay the sadness that all the people of Toril suffer. That is the very relic I seek. It would appear our paths have crossed for more reasons than one. Uh, 
the brothers entered a bargain with what they believed to be a spirit of fortune, but was in fact a demon named Belafoss. The bargain? Their fealty. For success in finding the moon tear. This was a most uneven bargain. They did. But they were powerless to break the bargain. Their minds already belonged to the demon. Over time, as the guild grew, the brothers became more and more insane under Belafoss's maddening influence. But one brother, Gareth, held on to his mind longer. He saw what was happening and tried to stop it by attacking Roth, who had already succumbed to the corruption. Our records ignore this part of our history. But the brothers fought furiously, tearing flesh and cracking bone like ravening mindless creatures until both died. With the Founder's deaths, the demon's bargain was completed, and Belafoss took the brothers' souls, leaving their guild free. You know, I wish you'd told me you were involved with demons when we met. You could really be a little more forthcoming. I cannot say. The Founder's death satisfied Belafoss's bargain. There is something... more at work here. You guys think Sorinil will settle for a little story about demons told by the ghost of a dead wizard? Looks like that's the best we'll get. We have... a lot to think about. Sorinil needs to know what we've learned here today. Here, before my mind is completely faded, take my final journal. May it inspire you on your quest. Now flee from here. Go! Well, we're not going to go yet. How may I serve? We have got some right looting away. to do. All right. Heads up! Trap! Ooh, yeah. Disarm it. Trap's clear. Oh, uh, we got a pike, a pole arm, hand axe, alchemist fire. If you say so. Scrolls. There we go. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why that switched to where they were following me. They're supposed to stand still. What have we here? Sure. Nice scroll. So that's all in that corner. Sounds like a plan. All right. And that's the way I come in. So I already checked those By ones out. Me, as go. you wish. Yes. Yes. At your Stop service. him searching. We're going to go to that other room and see if we can't At figure once. out that uh, the other puzzle before I we leave. That. Right away. As you wish. Of course. Ooh, 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 ooh. That wasn't good. I'm here to help. What is it that you require? Hurts. I can do that. Thought I could make it through, but apparently they got a little too close. Right away. Okay. Need summer. Can my rogue pick this lock? No, it's mechanically locked.
Again, I'm just seeing if there's clues to uh, the order that these get lit up or not. Doesn't look Probably like it. Eyes, just give it a try. Am I supposed to turn them all off or on? That's the question. Of course. At once. Hmm. I think I have to do both. That didn't work. White. I'll turn all of them on, correct? Hmm. There we go. Yeah. Hidden yeah. room. I think now I gotta try and turn them all sure. off to open this far door. Just gonna wait a couple seconds, make sure we don't find a trap on this thing. What is this? It's a two-handed slashing. Looks like a two-handed axe. That's actually pretty good. Oh, it's a uh, halberd. Sounds like a plan. All right. And this should do it. There we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Enemies at the gates. Everybody into position. Maybe we should try talking yes. to them. Talo charge forward. What can I do for you? Gonna go to Did my cleric and do blessing. What? See if we can't cast a fireball at those guys. At your service. Okay, we're gonna take down one at a time here. What do you need? Keep casting spells while we're at it. This guy is next. Can I help? What is it you require? Wow. Now this guy. Oh, how may I serve? What can I do for you? Cast Something that, I can do. cast that. Pretty simple fight. 
And fights go a lot easier if I'm able to get Taylo in first, and they all focus on him. I broke a nail on that one. Oh man. By your leave. I think we're safe. Yes. Sure. Uh, some frost giant strength potion. Sounds That's like nice. Plan. All right. I don't know why I keep going into stealth. There's no enemies in here. If you say so. Not even a hidden room, nothing. I'm here to that help. That kind of sucks. No, she's not getting anything either. Hmm. Need some. Well, boo to that. Okay. Right so away. I'm just gonna check the map. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we've explored everything. It's As time to go back to that room and head out the gate. Of course. And we're finished off in here. Where was that room? Over this way. Oh yeah, we gotta be careful of the fire. At once. Try not to get roasted again. I can do that. Wait for it. Right okay, away. go. As you wish. Of course. At once. I can do that. Right away. As you wish. Okay, and time to exit. Where's my other guy? Get in here, you stunty dwarf. You're so slow. You return to your camp, your mind reeling with what you have learned. The cursed ghost of Mathril speaks true. You know this in your heart and soul, and it lends some truth to the motivations of the murderous Gilded Eye. But in your heart also lies the truth that you and the remaining survivors of the Burning Dawn are free to choose your fate, to deny the demon its due. Or so you hope, as the crackling fire lulls you into the fickle arms of sleep. You have found answers in the haunted words of a dead wizard. But many questions remain. What drives the Knights of the Gilded Eye? What does the demon want from you? And if you are fated to bend to a demon's will, what role is left for you to play? Oh, looks like I got like a of course dream or something happening. I can do that. Oh, right away. Looks like as you wish. Of course, at once. I can do that. Oh, circle of bones is always nice. Right away. Where is the staircase to get me down? Right there. As you wish. Talk to you. Cries for you. The moon cries for you. The moon, the moon cries for you. Cries for you. The moon 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 cries. The moon cries for you. The moon cries. The moon cries. The moon cries. Well. Hello there. Hello there. Good to see you out and about. Seems there's been a shocking development or two. Is there something I can get for you? In the flesh, so to speak. I'm just hanging around here, serving drinks from beyond the grave. All in a day's work for Bellamy Lightfingers. You look terrible. It's the demons, isn't it? These aren't your normal starving, no skills, hit like a pillow fight demons. They're slaughtering us like animals. You most of all. Haven't you done enough? You let me die. Gil, Neddy, all the others. You've assembled a ragtag band of adventurers to what? Save the world? This is where we go when our roles are played out. When we've done all we can. We are all siblings in purpose. 
death, not by blood. What is that supposed to mean? It has been said for a century or more, by worse people and older beings than you. But now, let us sit back, relax and enjoy the show. And if you see Brynn, tell her, the moon cries for you. Looks like not everyone is who they said they were. Oh, that was weird. Another bloody nightmare. They're getting worse, I tell you. I think it's safe to say that you and Jarhild are the only ones having the nightmares. They must be related to your guild's link with Belafoss. Sounds like a fair assumption to me. I mean, I've done some crazy stuff. But allying with a demon? Oh, seriously? Wow. Right. We can't blame them. Anyone could fall for a trick like that. Ain't that the truth? We were supposed to report to Sorinel this morning. He said he'd meet us at the Cutlass. Hmm. I could use a bit of a drink myself. I just hope we don't have to go looking for him again. Aye, I can't help the feeling that we're in for a long day. As always. Yes, at once. So yeah, it's always empty. Hell, a training dummy. Oh! Not sure what that's for. I, I wonder if you can, like, that. retrain level, or retrain, or just train levels? I'm not sure. I guess it'd be like a retrain, maybe. Go to world travel. We want to go to the gates of Luskin again. Don't want to go to the high road. Don't want Luskin. Oh yeah, we do want Luskin. We want... The city gates. And we will take uh, the rogue, the cleric, and the wizard again. I like that party. The, the rogue, I would like to change for the uh, mage, but I don't think I want to go on with somebody who can pick locks. So the rogue it is. Keeps him in the party. Okay, we gotta go... Right away. Down here. So we do have a quest marker up there. I gotta talk to a few people. As you wish. Of course. Make sure we get everybody. Who is this dude and why is he important? So we talked to them already. Do 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 do. So we gotta talk to Shiril. Have her forge a deed.
All right. Well, that was easy. So that's one quest off the table. At once. What do we have over here? Apparently they killed some wolves and she wanted to keep the corpse as I a can do that. as a trophy, I suppose. I already sell all my ooze though. So, uh. Gives us a contact for somebody to sell ooze to. I think I might have already sold it all though. Looks like it. So, we still got a few quests to handle right here. So, we still gotta find. Uh, Rabil, somewhere. As you wish. Of course. Now we'll move on out. We'll head into the city. Where's my world travel? Right over here. Follow the main road, and out we go. We'll travel into the city again. Right away. See if we can't find this Rabil for this uh, Merc's dying wish. We found a mercenary in a cave in the. Uh, opening quest line and he wanted us to deliver something to his son for him the market district I guess we'll check it out go ahead and travel there see so cancel uh, just looking at the time it looks like this episode's been going on for quite a while so I think I'm gonna cut here and uh, travel into Luskin sell a bunch of stuff see if I can find that quest and finish him off, and then I will pick it up again once we head into the tavern and talk to, um, who's the dude? Sornil. So when, once I'm ready to talk to Sornil and continue on with the main storyline, I will cut back. So thank you everybody for watching, and I hope to see you again in the next episode.